Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading this week to help you see where the energies are aligning the best with you so that you can use them in ways that really support your well-being. Well, we have a week this week that is dominantly mental. It's about thinking, it's about figuring things out, and being clear in our minds about why we're doing what we're doing. You want to be focusing on how things can be done in a way that's sustainable, in a way that will carry through with its own energy at some point, so that you're not always having to stop and start and stop and start again. Um, you also want to be very focused on your own consciousness this week. This is a great time to expand your thinking, to explore deeper within, to become just more aware of all the layers of your own agendas and your own decision making and your own motivations and dreams about things. Flexibility is very important this week too. That's always necessary when we're trying to think things through. We've got to be flexible in that. We've got to be a bit creative and allow our minds to explore whatever they need to so that we can get to the clarity that we're seeking. This is about mental adventures. Adventures. Allow that processing in your mind to be something that is not a struggle, it's not pain. You may be processing a painful event, but don't interpret it as pain. Interpret it as an adventure into your being, something that will uncover whatever mysteries have been in your world and allow you to know how to work with them. One thing that we do need to watch out for this week is distorting our thoughts. Because there's so much focus on mental energy and on creating consciousness with that energy, one of the things that you'll find you're up against a number of times this week is places where you've misperceived something or you've seen something and you've assigned it a meaning that isn't necessary or isn't real. Um, that's a distortion of your thinking. So what you're looking to do is when you feel like I've got it but it doesn't quite align with reality, just keep working it a little bit more until you feel the puzzle pieces really coming close together. Distortion is something that when, we, when we're using it, when we aren't seeing clearly, we have a tendency to misinterpret other people's motivations, other people's interactions with us, and it creates friction. So it's not the most conducive thing to have in any sort of relationship. In summary for this week, you want to be focused on sustainability. You want to be creating things and doing things in a way that allows them to carry their own energy at some point so that you don't become drained by them and so that they don't become drained and cease to exist. You also want to be exploring your own consciousness and expanding it and deepening it. This is a wonderful, wonderful time to get to know yourself better. Be flexible in your perceptions and in your thinking. Let your mind get creative with things. Don't try to force things to fit into a square box or a known entity. Allow it to become new. Have an adventure with all of this this week. Don't make it hard work. Make it a lot of fun. And when you feel like maybe you don't understand something clearly, Assume that that's true, that you have a perception in there or a belief in there someplace that's causing you to distort reality for a minute. No big deal. Just accept that you might be doing that and look for the place where it comes together with the sharp clarity that we know reality is. Have yourself a great and wonderful week this week.